Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, I will be sharing another Dollar Tree Christmas haul. Yes, please. I'm so excited about all of this goodness that is sitting in front of me. If you missed it, I do have a Dollar Tree Christmas haul that I posted, I think, a couple of weeks ago, and I'll have the link to that video in the description box below. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump in. I don't even know where to start, so we'll just start right here with some Dollar Tree Christmas trees. So these little Christmas trees Dollar Tree comes out with every year, and they have them in green and in white. This year they also have them in a, like, I think it's like an iridescent white. So I have a couple of the green Christmas trees. They are very sparse looking little trees, but when you combine a couple of them together, they do look a little bit better. So I am going to use a couple of these this year as well as the white ones. I do have two white Christmas trees here that I'll probably use in Miss Olivia's room. Speaking of Miss Olivia Kate, I have some children's books right here. So these, oh my goodness, were only a dollar at the Dollar Tree. I literally bought some similar books like this last year at the Target Dollar Spot for three bucks. Now they are paperback and Miss Olivia loves books and loves story times. Definitely wanted to be able to have these and add them to our collection. They are Oh, so cute. This one here is the Lost Letter to Santa. The squirrel is absolutely adorable. It does come with 30 plus stickers, plus a postcard and a recipe card. And y'all, the little stickers, oh my goodness, are so, so cute. The recipe card is for hot chocolate and the postcard is absolutely adorable. I think this is so cute to like write a little letter to Santa. These are adorable or you can actually craft with these. These would make super cute crafts if you wanted to cut this out and put it in your um, Christmas planner or maybe like your little Christmas cookbook. That would be adorable. Next up we have something for Santa and you can see the little mouse is holding a plate of chocolate chip cookies and the recipe card is for mom's chocolate chip cookies. We have another cute little postcard. It says, thank you, Santa. This little book is just so stinking cute. I don't know if there was more to the little collection other than these two because my sister did get some books for Olivia as well from the Dollar Tree and they are like the Christmas seek and find books. They are for a higher age group as far as like the activities and finding and looking but they're definitely great for expanding vocabulary so I'm so glad that she got those and I think she picked up like four or five of them so there may be more to this collection and if there is, I highly recommend to pick these up if you see them. Okay, moving right along to some window clings. These are so cute. I love the little hot cocoa theme. These would make super cute DIYs for a hot cocoa bar. You could use them as window clings. You could use them for a little fun activity. This would be great for independent play. If you gave them to one of your kids, set them up. Maybe if you have like a little back door. You could also use these in DIYs and crafts if you want to apply them to wood just use Mod Podge and you're good to go. I also have some little tabletop decor pieces here and they are these two items. This one is oh so cute. It is a little mason jar with a poinsettia and it says have a jolly Christmas. If you watched my last haul, I did haul the one that had the little truck which was absolutely adorable too. These would just be cute on a shelf, a tiered tray, in your coffee bar, in your kitchen. They are so cute. Or you could also DIY them like if you're not into this little theme here. Just DIY it. And then this one here is just, oh my goodness, I love him so much. Santa is so cute. He says Merry Christmas. And he is glittery. So Merry Christmas is in a white glitter. His little mustache and his little hat accents are in glitter as well. But it's definitely very cute. Okay, next up we have some repeat items. They are the adorable little red truck ornaments with the bottle brush tree in the back. You get four for a dollar. You can't beat that. I believe they also sell these at Walmart as well. They're so cute for DIYs, crafts, or add them to your Christmas tree. Okay, next up we have some wall decor finds. And we'll start with this piece here. I feel like they do an item like this for every season. This one is so cute. I love the little wood look, the wreath. It's adorable. It says joy, peace, and Noel. So cute. And then y'all look at Mr. Santa. I love this piece. It's so cute. It's just like they did the fall scarecrow. He is adorable. I do believe on a few Instagram accounts I saw that people were also finding 
an elf and a snowman. So be on the lookout for that if you're maybe not into decorating with Santas. They also have those two options. Okay, I have another Santa to share with you and he is just too cute. I love his hat. I love that it says ho ho ho. He is too adorable. Okay, this next wall decor piece is just as cute. It says Believe. I love the little reindeer and he is a little pop-up. I just love everything about this piece. This would be cute next to a hot cocoa bar. I could see putting this maybe near my coffee bar. Love this piece. This next item may have been out last year. I'm not too sure because I know that they do this little like decor piece a lot. They did do it for fall time this year and I have one from last year or maybe even the year before that that is like fall themed. But this one is just so cute. It says Jingle Bells, White Christmas, Ho 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 with Santa's hat, which is so, so cute. Love this little piece. And then this little guy here is fun and bright. He is like, he does have a lot of glitter, but I still think it's really cute, especially if you want to hang this in like your kid's room. The little elf is adorable. It says sparkle and shine. It's Christmas time. Moving right along to some floral. I have three of these little galvanized pels here. They have these all year round. They're definitely a great buy for only a dollar. I love putting floral arrangements in these. So I have three of those and then lots of poinsettias. I personally really like the Dollar Tree poinsettias, but I only like a certain type. I think they have, they definitely have a variety of different poinsettias. I believe they even have some glittery ones. They have some, this is more of like their mid-tone red. They have a much more brighter red, but in my opinion, it looks just a little bit more artificial. And then they have a much deeper red that almost looks kind of burgundy or maroon. I love these poinsettias right here. I did a DIY a couple of years ago, maybe three years ago. I'll leave the link to that video in the description box below. I use some similar poinsettias like this. They have a little bit of greenery that's flocked with some red berries. It also comes with a little pine cone and you get quite a few of the poinsettias. I think they're so pretty. So I love to stock up on floral every season or holiday. So I am good to go here. Okay, moving along to some more little floral pieces. I have quite a few of these little decorative clips. These are amazing. They are a dollar. You get the greenery, the leaves, you get the berries, the pine cone, and the cardinal. And it does have a little flopped look. If your tree's looking a little sparse, a little bare in a few spots, you can just clip these into your tree for instant fullness. You can add them to floral arrangements, centerpieces, or gift toppers. I love picking up little decorative picks like this. Okay, moving along to some reef items. So I have some decorative mesh here on hand. I like picking up the Dollar Tree decorative mesh. It isn't always the most bang for your buck, but it's definitely affordable. And look here, we have some black and white buffalo check. Yes, please. This is such an exciting find. I know that they also had the black and red buffalo check, which I wish we were able to get our hands on that. But I believe when this stuff is hitting the shelves, it is flying fast. I think Meg was only able to pick up four, no, five rolls of this. So I should be able to make a wreath using this. And this is just such a cool find. Maybe you're not into making mesh wreaths. You could also use these in centerpieces. Or you could stuff them in your tree to make it look extra full. This is just such a cool and crazy find. If you can find the red and black buffalo check, pick it up because it will go so fast. So I do have a few rolls of the red mesh. I love picking this up and having it in my stash. It's great to use A for Christmas wreaths or centerpieces if you wanted to make a little swag. And it's great for all year round. You can use it for Valentine's Day, 4th of July, maybe your favorite sports team is red. I always keep some in my crafting stash. And then I also have some green mesh tubing as well as some red mesh tubing. I loved using this in my 
fall wreaths and my Halloween wreaths, which if you missed those videos, I'll have a link in the description box if you'd like to check them out. Okay, a few more crafting items. I have these little galvanized words here. They did have these last year and they say peace, joy, and believe. If you aren't into the galvanized like look, you definitely could paint them. I also have a six pack of their Jingle Bells in silver. I believe they also came in gold red and I think green. These are a great buy for a dollar, especially if you wanted to DIY them and give them more of like a rustic galvanized look. You could easily do that. I also have a pack of the wire garland ties. These are definitely great to use if you are making like larger swags or if you wanted to spruce up one of these Christmas trees as well as their 15 foot garland as well. Now this isn't the best, best quality, but it's definitely a great base and something to work with. Maybe you wanted to use your mesh and make something beautiful for your mantle or your staircase. This is definitely a great vibe. It gives you that very flexible, base that you would need to start. Use some mesh and you're good to go. Okay, next up I have a little tabletop decor piece here. It says Candy Cane Lane. This is absolutely adorable. I can see it at a coffee bar or a hot cocoa bar. We did see these during the fall time this year and last year. I actually did a DIY with one. I'll leave the link to that video in the description box below. I believe they also came out with some for Halloween, but this one for Christmas time, y'all, is absolute perfection. I love it so much. And I do think that they also have a couple of different prints and like different sayings on these as well. Okay, let's see what we have in this little goodie bag. We have some little wood cutout ornaments. We have, of course, the little truck with the Christmas tree. You just can't go wrong with these. And then I also have the little set that says Mary and it has the little deer for the Y, which is absolutely adorable. I have a few rolls of ribbon. We have this little burlap ribbon here with the little holly berries. This is absolutely adorable. I also have this little burlap ribbon with the red polka dots. Love this. It gives a more whimsical look to like your crafts and your DIYs. This is a ribbon that they have all year round. It is not just a Christmas ribbon. And then this one here is the small Buffalo check ribbon in red and black with some snowflakes. It is oh so cute and you get nine feet of each ribbon for a dollar. Okay, next up we have some Christmas cards. I love picking up their Christmas cards. I think they are so cute and for a dollar you just can't beat it. You can definitely punch them and add them to your Christmas planner. So I have this little set here with the truck that is the red and black buffalo check. It has the Christmas tree in the back. It is absolutely adorable. And on the inside of the card, it says, best wishes for a wonderful holiday that brings fond memories to last a lifetime. So you get 12 Christmas cards of this one design. And this little set here, you get 20 Christmas cards and envelopes, but you get, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. You get 10 different designs and these are oh so adorable. A few more crafting items. I have a little pack of the little mini bottle brush trees. These are just cute for DIYs. Non-Christmas item, but this is the wired jute cord. Great for crafting and great to add to your crafting stash. Okay, next up I have this little tree skirt here. It is the red and black a buffalo check print. It does have like the little furry bottom. If you don't need it necessarily for a tree skirt, it's great to just use the fabric for crafting. Alrighty, that is a wrap for today's Dollar Tree Christmas haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for spending a little bit of your time with me. I truly appreciate it. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not already subscribed. Hit that notification bell so that you don't miss my next upload and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.